I'm rebuilding the fireplace up. So I'm going to put a bit of sand and cement under this one, under my hot plate, get that level, and I'm going to cement the grate in so that'll be permanent, I think, because the last fire pit the grate kept slipping and I've built the rocks up higher at the back to give me a bit more reflective heat I've just got to come round here Try and get this great reasonably level because there's nothing worse when you're cooking and your oil's not sitting right in the in the pan. That's pretty good. So that's a hot plate bedded in, pretty flat, and the grill bedded in, nice and flat. And I'm just going to try and fill some of the holes in the uh, in that rock face at the back. That's most of the gaps filled in the rock. Just let that go off a bit and then I'll put some more in. It's looking good. It's looking really good.
pretty much finished now. I'm just gonna let it go off a little bit more and then just get a brush on the pointing bits just to smooth it off a little bit. I think I've filled most of the gaps now. So that should draft, lovely. And the grates uh, sealed in nicely there. And the two hot plates are sealed in, so it's looking good. And I've definitely got a bit more height at the back now. So you can see the, the kind of scale of it, and I can walk in as well, which is, well, crouch, crouch in. So yeah, I think it's uh, more sound than the last one with the, the sharp sand and cement. So I can't wait to spark her up, I'll probably spark her up tomorrow. And uh, do a cook up or something. Nice and uh, dry overnight. And me first fire in me new fire pit. The kettle's on where it should be. And well chuffed. So a nice little small fire. Let's dry it out a little bit more. Fire finishes it off lovely. Bit of orange amongst rock, can't beat it. So, thanks for watching, guys. Hope you enjoyed me building this. This is, a, this is a real focal point now of the camp. And uh, I'll catch you on the next one. Enjoy the great outdoors, guys. Cheers.